Mom, thank you for the shoulder to cry on. Dad, for the fun jokes and gourmet dinners. Ryan, your bake was some coffee in the morning, saved me. Um, and also thank you for being my built-in best friend. David, thank you for eating in my car in the mornings and for being the best little brother ever, even though you're already taller than me. And then Grandma, thank you for supporting me and my every endeavor. Thank you for showing up to my soccer games, band competitions, and concerts. The next person I would like to thank is Coloma. Thank you for helping me find my passion in music and for always pushing me to be my best. I would also like to thank you for being there for me, whether it was band-related, personal problems, or our fun talks with Nikki in the band room of Chinese food. I couldn't thank you enough for all that you've given me over the past five years. I'd like to say thank you to Miss Inglis. Although you made me wash your dishes and water your garden, you're someone who was vital to me in my junior year. You gave me guidance when I was lost, and you were just there. Also, your snack for us. Finally, I would like to thank Mr. Foster and Coach Buffington. While I know Foster isn't at Fair Grove anymore, he still impacted my life and I'm forever grateful. Buffington and Foster helped me grow in my faith, which could arguably be the most important thing that I learned over the years. They kept my love for the Lord on fire, and that is something that will change my life forever. I've been so blessed beyond measure here at Fair Grove. So, if you follow the simple rules that I gave you, enjoy the little things, don't stress, and be thankful, you should have no problem surviving the zombie apocalypse after high school we call life. Again, I would like to say thank you to everyone, and congrats to the class of 2022. We made it.